Yo guys, what's up? We got the picks for Monday Night Football. I got three plays for you guys. That is going to 5x your money in this video. We're going to hop into it in a second. But first guys, if you did not watch the Sunday video, this is the best channel on YouTube. This is the best picks you guys can find anywhere for free. Look at this. Swept NFL Sunday. I guarantee you guys have never seen that on another YouTube channel. Absolutely guarantee it. Swept it, went six for six. This is a 25X play for NFL Sunday. Let's go. All these plays were basically swept free except the kicker. But other than that, we absolutely crushed it. We also hit a 10X play in VIP right here. So the VIP members also hit on that and profited in VIP. Last Monday Night Football, we cashed a three-man. So today, another three-man for you guys. Guys, make sure to drop a like on the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. You guys do not want to miss any of these free pick videos I drop for you guys pretty much every single day for college football and NFL. Again, guys, swept today. So trust me when I say you don't want to miss these videos. Just make sure to subscribe to the channel. Like 70% of the people watching my videos aren't subscribed. I cannot explain to you why. After watching last video, after seeing this, I don't, I could not explain why someone would not be subscribed and watching these videos for the free plays. And if you are new here, if you guys want to get in VIP, I give you even more free plays. So if you guys cashed on Sunday with the free plays, Let's go. I got even more free plays for you guys, and I will text it directly to your phone every single day to get in VIP for an entire month for completely free. All you have to do, it takes five minutes at most. All you have to do, go to the links down below, download this app, Parlay Play. I know most of you guys don't have it, so you all should be able to do it right now, and it's available in a lot of states, so make sure to check if it's available in your state because some people think it's not. It's available in those states. Check it. Parlay Play. Download it with the links below. Use code GHOSTLOCKS. Make sure you actually use the code GHOSTLOCKS, all caps, no spaces. Exactly like this. I'll put it at the bottom of the screen. Make sure you use code GHOSTLOCKS. Deposit at least 10 bucks. Drop a comment on this video saying, hey, I used your code. And I will send you guys the link to the free month of VIP. So that is it. You just have to deposit on this app at least 10 bucks with code GHOSTLOCKS. Drop a comment and I'll send you guys that link to the free month of VIP. So pretty much everyone watching this video should be in VIP at this point. I'm doing it as a favor for you guys because we've been making so much money. You guys can see we're up over 50 units on the season in VIP. So we're doing this on the YouTube channel. It's amazing. It's great. But we're doing even better over on the VIP. Again, up 50 units. So go right now. Use the links below. Make sure you type in Ghost Locks. Make sure you actually deposit on the app. And then drop a comment down below. You also get a hundred dollar deposit match. So why not make extra free money? I know a ton of people watch these videos to try to make money. You could guarantee yourself a hundred dollar deposit match just by hopping on the app right now with that code as well. So free hundred bucks, free month of VIP. Make sure to go do that again. All the links are down below. It takes five minutes tops. So make sure to do that. But let's lock in. So again, three more free plays for you guys in this video. The first play we're gonna do. We're going to go to Josh Allen. So the way this game, I think, is probably going to go, and by probably, I mean I'm pretty confident this is how the game is going to go. It's going to be more of a slow-paced game. I really think it's going to be a slow-paced game. Josh Allen is having his toughest matchup of the season, and by toughest matchup of the season, I mean the Jets are the best defense in the league passing wise, at least for quarterbacks, quarterbacks going up against the Jets so far in the season. This Jets defense is by far and away the best defense against quarterbacks. So this is going to be the hardest possible matchup he can have in the NFL in the entire league. So this is a great spot to take his under in fantasy. You guys can see he's only gone over two out of these five games and those two games he went over, he crushed it, absolutely killed it. So, so far on the season, unless he's crushing it and killing the line, he doesn't hit it. He had eight right here against Baltimore, only 14 against Houston and only nine against Miami. Again, this Jets matchup is so good. I think this game is going to be very, very slow paced, a lot of field goals, a lot of running the ball from both teams. Josh Allen might not have James Cook in this game. He's questionable. He most likely will be able to play. So they should be handing the ball off a decent amount in this game. Both teams should be. Um, but again, Josh Allen, 18 and a half. This line also just seems really high in general. Like I said, he's only gone over two out of these five games. So I think the line in general is really high, but especially, you know, at the Jets stadium, nighttime. It is a primetime game, but overall, when he's played the Jets throughout his career, he's done decent. He's kind of getting, you know, a little bit over 200 passing yards every game. Sometimes scores a couple touchdowns. I think last year he had a game with one touchdown and a game with three touchdowns, but he also tends to have a lot of turnovers. So picks, fumbles, 
gets turnovers for sure. So to get over 18 and a half, he would need like 50 rushing yards, two or three touchdowns, and then no turnovers. I don't even think he gets two or three touchdowns. I think he's probably going to only have one touchdown. But even if he gets two touchdowns passing or running, I still think we hit this play of under 18 and a half for Josh Allen. So I really, really like that line. I think they might even bump that line down before kickoff actually starts. So I like that line. Get that line while you still can at 18 and a half because I do think they'll bump it down. The second play I have, we're going to uh, keep going with the Bills here. We're going to take Tyler Bass over one and a half field goals. So this kind of just correlates and goes along with what I was saying about Josh Allen, where I think it's going to be a slow paced game, a lot of running the ball. A lot of field goals can't really get into the end zone. So this correlates because if Josh Allen goes less on fantasy score, obviously he's not scoring a ton of touchdowns. So he's getting stopped in the red zone. Tyler Bass will be able to kick that field goal. Now, Josh Allen is obviously good enough on his own to get his team uh, basically across the 50 yard line to field goal range. And then, after that, the Jets' red zone defense, really, really good. So that's why I think Josh Allen, he will be able to move the ball. That's why we're not taking his under on passing yards, but we're taking under on fantasy score because I just don't think he'll be able to actually get it into the end zone multiple times this game. And so that's why we're also going to correlate that with Tyler Bass over on field goals. The Jets also have allowed top five most fantasy points to field goal kickers this year. So it's a really good matchup in general for him. Um, again, that has to do with their red zone defense. And he's gone over every other game here. So he's either gotten one or two every game. But the best thing about this is this game where he had these two games where he only had one, he missed a field goal in those games. So every game he's had at least two uh, field goal attempts. And so that's really what we're looking for. As long as he doesn't miss one of these field goal attempts, he should be able to hit both those field goals and hit that play right there. The third and final play we're going to do to 5X the money, we're going to be taking Brees Hall. So this is probably, I don't know if I'd say it's my favorite play. I would definitely say it's the most interesting play on the board. We're going to take his over rushing attempts at 13 and a half. The reason we're taking over on rushing attempts, you guys can see he's at three out of these five games. These last two games, he didn't really get close. That also has to do with the fact they were losing those games, so they couldn't be running at the end of the game. They were passing a lot towards the end of the game, so that's kind of why he missed those two games. Other than that, he hit the three other games, but the reason I like this play a lot is because the Bills run defense, bottom three in the league. They have a really really bad run defense. So I think he was going to do good in general on the ground and the Jets should in general, him and Braylon Allen should both do pretty well on the ground against the Bills because everybody does. But on top of that, the Jets, since they fired their head coach, which a lot of you guys probably heard about, they have a new offensive play caller. Now the new offensive play caller keeps talking about how he wants this to be a run first offense. They're not running the ball enough. He wants to run the football. So that is why I really like taking his over on rush attempts. This offensive play caller, he was the offensive coordinator for the Titans in 2021 and 2022 when Derrick Henry was, was really at his peak with the Titans, you know, dropping all those crazy, um, records and stuff like that with the Titans. So this guy knows how to call offensive play calls, to run the damn football, okay? So I really like the Jets' backfield in this game. That's why we're going to be taking over on Brees Hall 13 and a half. This play, I would say it's an absolute lock. I really love the play. The only thing is, what if the guy's lying? You know what I mean? A lot of guys, a lot of offense coordinators and stuff say that, and they don't actually do it. If he doesn't, he screwed us over, and we missed the play because he screwed us over. But from what he is saying, Brees Hall should have no less than 15 rush attempts in this game. Easy. So I really like that play right there. I like all three of these plays, and this is the play we're going to have, the three men we're going to have for the game on Monday night. Guys, make sure to drop a like on the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel again so you don't miss any of the free picks. Guys, this is ridiculous going six for six. I mean, easy money. We cashed last Monday night football as well. So guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Make sure to drop a like. And then last but not least, guys, again, make sure you get in VIP. I made it free to help you guys out Take the five minutes out of your day. You're watching a video to figure out what plays to bet. Just get in VIP, and then I send you guys the plays every single day, and we're up over 50 units. You literally just have to deposit 10 bucks on an app with code GhostLocks. It's really that easy. So once you download it and deposit with code GhostLocks, make sure to drop the comment down below so I, I can actually find you and send you the link to the free month of VIP. And then real quick, if you guys already have Parlay Play and you can't deposit on that app for the first time with that code, you guys can do the same deal on Chalkboard or Sleeper. 
The only difference is this code ghost on these apps and not code ghost locks. So you could just get on chalkboard or sleeper code ghost deposit 10 bucks, drop a comment. I'll send you a link to a free month of VIP. As long as you guys use a promo code, I'll send you guys a link to a free month of VIP. That's literally, it's that simple. If you deposit with the code, you get a free month of VIP. So just make sure to drop a comment so I could actually send you that link. But other than that, guys, these are the plays for the games on Monday night. Let's sweep back to back Monday nights and back to back days here on the channel. But other than that, guys, good luck with all your picks and I'll catch you in the next video.